Hello there and welcome back to Martin Circus Skills Workshops and I guess that you're here because you're into balloon modelling or magic or circus skills or something that's kind of related to one of those areas which are all kind of related to each other uh, but thank you for tuning in and what I've got for you today I'm going to tell you how I'm going to show you how to make a super cool one balloon teddy bear and yet yeah, all you need is a single 260 now a teddy bear is an absolutely fab design and blue modelers love doing this because it is a kind of quite you know it's an iconic design but there are some things that they do worry about and because it's got a few pinch twists in and if you haven't quite sort of got a nice soft blue you can end up popping quite a few balloons, but I'll try and give you one or two tips to avoid the balloons popping on you. So without further ado, let's get on with it. So what you need is a single 260 balloon. You want to leave a good hands width. Okay, about that much. If it's a little bit more, it doesn't matter. And you're gonna give it a good squeeze. Now, before you do the teddy bear, or really anything with lots of pinch twists in, make sure that the glue is nice and soft it's on the soft side so what you start off with is start with a knotted end and about a three finger bubble about that size okay. and then you're going to do a one finger bubble so about that size and now you're going to do a series of sort of two two and a half finger bubbles one finger bubbles so that's my two, two and a half finger bubble. I'm going to do another finger bubble. I'm going to do a series of these. I'm going to do three of each. So that's what you should have. You should have one, two, three of these sort of two finger, two and a half finger bubbles and three of the one finger bubbles. You can probably see my finger and thumb sort of diving over there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this twist and twist it into here. Okay, just here where I've got my fingers. Yeah, I've got my little finger. So I'm just going to take that, twist it there. Now don't worry if, if your first twist comes undone, nor will really, really, really do that thing be. And that's what you should have. Now if you see my twist hasn't come undone. If it does, just do it again. Now you're going to take the first bubble that you twisted at the end of the blue with the knot and you're just going to push it through this gap here and make sure you push it well through and you are ready to go now you are ready probably to do the most tricky fiddly bit with the pinch twist so you're going to take this one finger bubble here this one here and you're just going to lift and just twist so you've got one pinch twist and i'm going to do the same with the other one finger bubble on the other side Lift and twist and there you have that iconic teddy bear sort of face and design which is a standard for you know quite a few of the blue model designs as well you know like a tiger that has that similar kind of design so it's a really really good design to learn how to sort of do uh, a teddy bear's head because you do use it in lots of other blue model designs so what i'm going to do now is the body and literally that's going to be sort of four finger bubbles four 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 finger bubbles so it's nice and easy do make sure that they are pretty much the same size again they don't have to be absolutely accurate and so you've got your four bubbles that you can see there. I'm going to take this bubble here that I'm sort of wiggling around and I'm going to put it into the neck just where I've got my finger there. You can see jiggling my finger and I'm just going to twist it into there. So here we go, we've got the, you can see the teddy bear taking shape. Now you want plenty left. Now you've probably got nothing left uninflated. But your blue should be pretty soft still. 
it's really tight, you're probably going to struggle and do this. So you go down here, about a four finger bubble, do the twist, twist it into the bottom here. So it goes down the back, twist it into there. You're going to do another four finger bubble. Now I've got quite a lot here, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to twist it in. And I'm going to actually just pop this off, because that is a lot. Let the air out. And there you have your one balloon teddy bear. I'm just going to add some decoration with a sharpie. So a couple of cute eyes. And you can have some fun. Uh, a cheeky little smile. And there you have your super cool one balloon teddy bear. So I hope you've enjoyed that. It's a really good design to know. It's really, really popular with kids. Kids love this. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed that. Um, this is social media, so you probably know what I'm going to say here. But don't forget, if you enjoyed this video, hit me up with a like. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Hit that little, hit that little bell icon, so you'll know when I. You'll be the first to know when I ever upload anything. Uh, some new content, new material. But once again, thank you for taking the time to watch this. I hope you enjoyed this. And this is goodbye from Martin Circus Skills Workshops. Bye-bye.